Hey guys, welcome to a brand new series. This is Cricket19. I'm Joe, if you're new around here. And make sure you do click that subscribe button for daily Cricket19 content. Uh, and also daily retro and sports gaming content. So, um, yeah, this series we're going to be doing our world uh, Cricket World Cup with England. Obviously, it's World Cup year. Uh, later in the summer, we'll do an Ashes series as well. But... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. We'll get some up-to-date teams, why not? Uh, we'll just uh, wait a minute for that. And uh, we'll do a new World Championship with England. We're going to play every match, hopefully go and win the thing. Um, that would be wonderful if we can do that. Uh, but yeah, uh, make sure you do click that subscribe button if you do want to uh, see it all. So we'll play as England. Uh, right, let's see if we can... Um, Hold on, options. So we can add a player. Okay, so there's a lot of players here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know who any of these are, unfortunately. Uh, James Anderson. Why isn't he in there? I mean, I know he's, he doesn't play one day cricket. Joe Denley in there, Liam Plunkett. Uh, right, and then let's... Let's go back to our squad. So we've got to delete a few players now. Uh, let's, whoops. What was can you Can you sort it by uh, overall? Apparently, apparently not. But we can uh, at least see. Uh, Mark Wood, I'm sorry, mate, but you're going to have to go 71 rated. Uh... Who else in there? I mean, there's Chris Woods, Jofra, uh, Chris Walk, sorry. Um, okay, maybe Liam Plunkett we can get rid of. One more. I know James Anderson doesn't play uh, one day cricket, but uh, I think it'll be fun to have him in. Liam Dawson, 82. I didn't know Liam Dawson was that good. Uh, hmm. Might, might be making a mistake here, but I'm going to get rid of Liam Dawson. I think we've got two better spinners in the squad in Rashid and Ali. Uh, so we'll get rid of him. And uh, that will be our 15-man uh, World Cup squad. So we're playing South Africa today uh, in this episode. Obviously, it's going to be the first uh, game of the World Cup in real life as well. Which will be fantastic. So we've got the, the ODI strip there, the World Cup strip. Uh, we've got some match information. We can e edit the lineup, so let's have a little look. Uh, Stu Broad isn't playing, neither is Anderson. So let's get Anderson in for uh, Curran. Why not? Uh, so we'll have Anderson in there. We'll make him the opening bowler. Okay, so we need to do that. And then Chris Walks can be the, the second bowler. We've got uh, Adil Rashid in there as well. He won't be uh, number 11. We'll stick out Jofra Archer. Well, Anderson, then Archer. Walks, uh, Rashid, Ali, Walks. That looks good. Stokes, Butler, Morgan, Root, Bairstow and Jason Roy. Got Alex Hales as the 12th man. Broad, Curran and Denley miss out this time. So that looks absolutely fine to me. Uh, so, yeah, let's get into the, the match then. Yeah, this is going to be an interesting one. Uh, we won't be playing the full 50 over match in this episode. We will just be um, sort of doing uh, 10, 10 overs here and there. Um, and hopefully this series will go all the way up to the, um, the, the final of the World Cup in July. So strap in tight. It's going to be a long one. I think there's nine possible matches something like that uh obviously there's eight teams at the world cup so we we play each team once and there's a semi-final and final hopefully as well um but I, I do like this uh, menu on the new cricket 19 game but by the way before people say uh, how did i get early uh, came in the post uh, nice and early on uh saturday uh, so four days before release 
so I was a very lucky boy. I ordered it from the game collection in the UK uh, and managed to get earlier. I'm guessing it's something to do with the bank holiday weekend because obviously there's no post today, which is Sunday, no post tomorrow, which is Monday. So the next posting day is Tuesday. So they're probably leaving it a bit fine if they if they didn't post it on Friday. So there, yeah. uh, hey ho. Anyway, uh, let's get into the match. He's on fire. This is superb stuff. Oh, what a leap. Takes a superb catch. What a win. That's done it. The whole team running over to celebrate. Well, that's a little bit awesome. Fantastic. Good morning and welcome to this 50 over match between England and South Africa. I'm Michael Slater and with me in the commentary today is James Taylor. Thanks Slaps, good to be here for this match. The clouds have come over and there is some rain in the area. Hopefully it will pass us by. Hard to say what the captains will do here. England have to be favourites here but should still be a good match. So there we go. We're all ready to go then uh, for Over this match. The Not a full house. The toss. Here we go. And there's uh, Nasser Hussein and Nick Knight. <laughs> and the big hand currency, of course. South Africa win the toss. What are they going to do first? Uh, they are going to bat first so we're going to be doing a bit of bowling uh, slight disclaimer we're not probably going to bowl for the whole of this episode I will skip it uh, I think the batting is much more interesting on this game but we will bowl a, a few of us and see if we can uh, get some get some wickets hopefully so here we go ready to go nice close up on the on the ball there <laughs> Jimmy Anderson is going to be the man the myth, the legend, that opens up this World Cup with the first delivery. But I really like this presentation style. You can see they've worked really hard on it, and it's uh, it's getting the, the juices flowing, ready for this match. I think it's at the Oval, uh, of which I'm pretty sure it won't be in real life. It will be at Lord's, I would imagine. But uh, here we go. We're ready. It's Jimmy Anderson. He's going to ball the first ball of this match. So here we go. I genuinely have goosebumps. Not the, not the best ball. I have moved the camera to broadcast two on the field and since the uh, first look. I know a couple of people uh, asked us to switch it up. No shot on offer very that, happy huh? to do it. Bad start from us. Jimmy Anderson looks pretty good. Um, his graphics, at least. <sighs> Bit of frustration showing with that appeal. <laughs> no, doesn't Just thought we'd uh, appeal it. No, oh, we we're not challenging that. Don't worry. <laughs> Imagine. in the air for a split second there. Let's try an in-swing in the auger to end the over here. What a delivery. Draws the edge. Ends the over and the score hasn't moved. But I made an over to open up our World Cup campaign. Now then, I wonder if these names are made up. Uh, South Africa at the moment. Uh, yeah, I think they are, unfortunately. Uh, that's a little bit annoying. The from the northern end. 
So I'm guessing there's no community stuff. Because obviously the game hasn't come out yet fully, so... Um, but uh, hopefully I'll be able to download some teams on uh, on Tuesday um, or whatever when it's released. I don't think we'll get much past this match, so uh, it won't really matter. Um, so I know it's just start again, get the same result if you if you get us. Um, we're gonna have it all sorted for the uh, the next match. It shouldn't matter too much, you know. We've got England. Oh, overthrows. <laughs> um, yeah, it shouldn't matter too much because uh, you know our players are fine. Ball of beating them all ends up. So. Yep. Plays that nicely. Oh, it's a lovely shot. That's going to be four. Unless we can reach it, which we do. Amazing enough. Nice fielding back there. to the wicket keeper. So I don't want these videos to be too long, you know, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, that sort of length. Um, before people ask, there, there will not be any sort of highlights, and, you know, that's just not my style. Uh, full live commentary and, um, you know, showing all the match. That's what I'll be doing. But yeah, as I said, we'll probably simulate the, the ball and uh, innings for the most part. I just I just don't find it as fun, personally. Go for an out swing in Yorker this time. Yep. Nothing the batsman could have done better. Yeah, right shot. Ball. I think it was more of an edge than anything else. I kind of did want to see that again, but it skipped. Unfortunately. So I think uh, H. Albats is uh, Hashim Amla. <laughs> it's like playing the old Brian Lara games. Yeah. I think we'll probably s skip forward a few overs after this delivery. That's nice going to be a wide. I think. Well wide. Yeah. Just in time that releases as well as I, I should have hoped. Wait there. Oh, I thought that was a catch there. Reasonably Must have been a bump ball. There. there you go. Alright, so let's simulate. Simulating will deserve build certain trophies. That's absolutely fine. Um, so we'll stop after 15 overs or so. Or 20 overs, that seems good to me. So let's begin the simulation. There we go, Jimmy Anderson. Three wickets for him. The right arm so come back on now. He's coming into the attack from the northern end. Anderson is eighth over, or ninth over. This will be actually. He's already got three wickets. We'll be hoping for more. Is it Faf Duplessis? Dutoit? Goes through to the wicket keeper. Wow. Nice shot offered. That didn't carry at all, did it? Unless Anderson's just knackered. That's a nice ball. Slightly in the air there, but not bad. Delivery information, right? Off cutter or variation? Sorry, go for an off cutter. 
damn it. Just sometimes does that. Uh, uh, double presses for some reason. Um, what's this? Oh, this is a spell. Okay. I'll tell you what, what we'll do is, is we'll go into the tactics and change the uh, next bowler. Because I bet you it's walks, yeah. Um, let's go for Jofra Archer. We'll have a little, a little look at him in this uh, game. That's a good shot. Very tidy over. End of the over. Archer, the pace bowler, is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Now, this guy is meant to be the bee's knees. And that brings up the fifty partnership. That takes this partnership to fifty. Nice little uh, announcer in the background. Nice and clear. Which is always nice. Go on. Oh, that's a shame. That is a shame. That was a glove, definitely. Just a lack of concentration there. And leg by, apparently. Let's go for the yoga. Might go for a slower ball yoga, try and catch him out. No, didn't work. So we'll do this over and then probably skip the rest of it, just so we get some batting into this episode as well. Um, but yeah, hopefully you're enjoying so far. It certainly plays quite nicely. Uh, I, I, uh, I am enjoying playing it at the moment. Yes! We get him! And what a ball that is! And it was an edge! Well, that's disappointing from uh, Duplessis there. And he's gone for 25. Ball by Jofra Archer. It's 104. 108 for 4. And here comes Harry Cridge. The new batsman takes guard. Right. So, oh no, we've got another, we've got another ball or so to go for here. I'm gonna go for a Yorker first ball. Nicely played. And that completes a very good over. So let's uh, move it on another twenty overs. They're doing all right now. Well, I'll tell you what, what we'll do is is we'll bowl the last two overs. Right. Oh, last one over, I guess. Who's going to be bowling Archer. it? Joffre Archer. So here we go. Last over. Only on 280 at the moment. <sighs> Bit of desperation appealing for that. <laughs> no challenge. I would like to maybe use the challenge at some point in this over if I get the the opportunity. Yep. That's right, high in the air. That one nicely. Oh, sure. but it's through the gap, and that's going to be four. Four marvellous runs for South Africa there. Right then. I'm going to go for a slower ball here. Not able to connect. Now I can hear a plane. I don't know whether it's in real life or on the game. It might be on the game. I think what it is. <laughs> right. So here we go. And they get through for one. Right then. Gonna do an off cut our final ball of this innings for South Africa. Yep. What 
Time and it was Edge. Well, but certainly not about over seven off the final over of the innings. And uh, well, we'll settle for that. Two hundred and eighty-eight to win. We'll certainly settle for that one. I love these little uh, highlight reels. I really do like them. Nice shot there for four. But I do wonder whether they just show the ones that you've seen or whether they show the, the ones uh, from the simulation as well. That was a lovely delivery. Got the wicket, of course. In the air. But no, it's, it's a very nice presentation wise, this game. Beautiful. But there you go, there's the scorecard. So 104 Daniel Martin and 94 Harry Cridge. This will be, hopefully, the only match with uh, not real players. Exciting run chase here. A good target has been set. Let's see if they can defend it. Yeah, here we go, Jason Roy. And Johnny Bairstow come to the crease as Kaspar Rampersad comes in. Ball and aggressive. So 288 to win. Around about six and over. Yeah, I want to get rid of that um, circle around the ball, actually. That's something I do want to do. Probably before the next episode, I'll manage to, to get that done. On the pads, and that's going to be four. Good shot. I have got uh, batting on hard now. So, I think. Uh, is it on here? Difficulty. Uh, oh. Yeah. Oh, th this shouldn't be the case. I did do this on the... Ah, okay. So, bowling's on easy. Um, I have that on medium. I have that on default. Uh, put the AI on... The, ah, new difficulty one. Because this is what I did. I did it on new difficulty. So that's that's what it'll be. Um, so yeah, let's stick the, the AI on legend. Why not? Um, that's good. Right. Uh, let's see if I can get the... Um, what, was, what would it be under? Ball trail? I don't want a ball trail. I wonder if that's what's under. Pitch marker. Bowling. Input hood. No idea. Fielder marker. Right, well, let's have a little look. See if that does the trick. But, uh, nice little shot there. But, yeah, hopefully now it's on hard. It'll be a little bit better. Now that didn't really do the trick, unfortunately. It didn't get rid of the, the circle around the ball, but uh, I'm sure you guys will uh, uh, spot it in the comments where I need to do it. Um, that's a cracker. Full ball, full toss almost. Lovely drive. That's going to be four runs every day of the week. Defend the likes of that. Let's see, a couple of little gaps here and there. Get the single. Not too bad. So end of the over nine off it. We'll probably go up to five overs or so, and that'll take us up to uh, around about the half an hour. Mark for the episode. Obviously, we'll do a lot more overs, batting wise, Didn't in like the, the next one. one. No shot offered. I'm surprised that's not an overhead wide, but uh, we can't bowl any more short ones this over. Just leave them. They're just there for tempness. 
on car follies or anything on the pads. Mm, this could be close. Oh, we're all right. Just about. Ooh. Ooh. Risky. Risky running. Didn't quite hit that as well as I wanted. I was trying to hook it really, but uh, didn't quite come to fruition. Well, that should be that should be a no ball. Yeah, wide. You can't ball that many. Uh, short. Balls. No, then not be punished for it. Yeah, you mustn't get a free hit for a wide. That's out. We just fished for that one, and that's a poor, poor shot, really. Uh, no challenge. Yeah, we've gone inside edge on that, and Jason Roy, unfortunately, is gone for ten. South Africa make the breakthrough. And that was uh, just poor shot selection, really, this early in the innings. You know, we've got 50 overs to make a move on them. What a delivery that was. I was trying to sort of pull that. Again, uh, tempted into the drive there and possibly should have just left that. Quite the best time in there. Still haven't scored any runs off this over. Mm, that's got to be an overhead wide. Got to be. Yep. <laughs> I was trying to hook it, but that was just never going to happen. That's a bit better. Okay, we didn't time it well, but. That's exactly what we wanted to do. Root is the new batsman about to face his first ball. Joe Root, the test captain, of course. Block out the first delivery. End of the third over. 14 for one. Just need to build our innings here. Don't need to panic and, you know, rush. Oh, the swing on that is crazy. That pitch, outside leg. You were thinking, oh, nice, easy one on the pads, but swung past off stump. Mm, that was a little bit better, but... Mm, nah. If we were being more aggressive, that would have been an overthrow run, but uh, didn't quite happen. And here he comes in. Might have been a chance to play one off the pads, but don't want to risk it too much early on. I think we learned our lesson with Roy. Yep. That's alright. Nice on the pads. We're going to come back for two. And two runs added to the scoreboard. 17 for one at the moment. Just going to leave off those it. ones. Amazingly, that wasn't a wide. <laughs> I'll tell you what, it swings a bit, this ball. Yep. On this game. 
single to end the over. Good four overs man. gone, 18, 18 for one. one. That comes steaming in for the final over of the episode. Get back. Again, it's short ball. I like the short uh, deliveries here, South Africans. Oh, need a run. Oh, one more added. Just about. So yeah, we'll finish this over, and then we'll uh, we'll pick up where we left off in the next episode, which will be That's released tomorrow. Nice shot offered. That's going to be a wide, truly. Yep. Shot there. I love some of the panning shots on this game, uh, of the, the panning camera angles, and love it. Yep. Just think it's a really well presented game. Really makes you feel the immersion, and I love the little intro bit at the start of the match, and I hope they do that for for every match of the World Cup. That would be really, really cool. Quick single in there at the end of the over. Not a bad one. Six off it. 24 for one after five. So that is where we're going to leave it for today and this first episode. If you have enjoyed that, then make sure you leave a like. It really does help me out. means a lot to me as well, especially on part ones. It really can make all of the difference. So if you did enjoy it, hit that like button. Let me know down in the comments what you think. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to continue this World Cup and uh, hopefully lead England to glory. Subscribe to the channel for daily Snooker, nine, snooker 19 and Cricket 19 videos. <laughs> I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.